on this episode of That's Her Life. Get an inside look of my catering business. I'm going to write these prices down so I know what they are. Okay, you'll like to place an order? I love what I do. As well as me doing a couple of errands. We'll take a trip to the grocery store as you see a couple of things that I grabbed for my business. How much is it for a case? Can I just get it in the case? Because <laughs> I buy green so much. And also see the things that I do as a single mother as I take my daughter to school to meet with the dean. Oh, they got a real jump rope. So we walk into the building and I was just thinking like this school is pretty big. And later that night, get a feel on how I prep my meals for my customers, getting things ready for my business the next day. Can I get the applesauce out the refrigerator, please? In the jar. And then come to Whoa! Yeah, look at This is my life. beautiful people I am Alyssa I am a single mom and I have my own business I cater I actually cater vegan food and I love what I do Hello. hi okay you'll like to place an order I actually have four little ones that I tend to as well. I'm a single mom. And this is for Thanksgiving. Okay. What the consist of? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. A lot. Okay, so I can tell you some of the things that we have on our menu for Thanksgiving. So we have our macaroni and cheese. Um, it ranges from $10 to $45 just because of the size. So today me and Miss Lyric Rose had to grab a couple of things from the store. Here, you can hold it first. And I'll take your boot. There you go. Are you ready now? So you can just go right out again. So you have your book and Mommy has her book. Where are you going to go, Mommy? We are going to go to the store. Can you help me with everything else at the store? <laughs> grab things for Thanksgiving. <laughs> Collard greens and create more things of that nature. Tomatoes and potatoes. <laughs> are you going to get in the car or are you going to help push? I feel like you're going to get in the car. Uh, see, I knew that. How did I know that? Because you got chips. We have a lot to get. I see a bird, and that's a big dinosaur. Yeah. So, we have to get all three of them, actually. So, we're at the store. I grabbed my list. Yeah, we're right there. There you go. Just to check and see if the next time I come back, I'll be able to get these in bulk. I'm gonna write these prices down so I know what they are when I get them in bulk. Hi. Hi. Okay, you know what? I have one to ask you guys too. How much is it for a case? Could I just get it in the case? Because <laughs> I'm eye green so much. <laughs> So just heading back home so I can make sure I get to my daughter's school on time to meet with the dean. This is going to be her first day attending a new school, so she's kind of excited. I'm excited, so. Oh, they got the real jump rope. I'm on a run. So today we went to check out my new school. No, he better be here. <laughs> I don't even know if it's a woman. Is it a woman? She said meet the dean. Usually the dean is a man. Usually it's a woman, mom. It was raining the other day. It was raining the other day. You now were very So we walk into the building and I was just thinking like this school is pretty big. Like 
like it lost or you know, it's just in the zone like how big it was. So I was pretty nervous and I wasn't sure how I was gonna like the school. So how'd you like it? It was okay. So what do you think is gonna be different from this school from the other school proposed to? A lot of people. I'm not gonna be like feeling like I'm the only one who always works in class. Oh, and raising your hand and participating. Yeah. I actually felt like because ever since last year, I was part of a lot of stuff. So this year, I try to get out of the stuff because like how the students are here, I'm like, there's probably like, different crowds. Because it's bigger, you're going to be shy? Yes, because the smaller I interact with people, I know them really well. And to the point Come here, Rose. it doesn't cause a lot of drama and stuff. So it's really easy for me just to like raise my hand. Everybody raises their hand because everybody knows the answers. I just stuck with the crowd that wasn't popular or seen. I think that this one would be better to be, like, to be honest. You just need to focus more. So tonight we were just doing a little bit of meal prepping. Um, I usually just have the kids to help me in the kitchen with our meal prepping. Because it goes a little smoother when I have my extra hands in the kitchen, even if it's them taking out trash or, you know, helping me cook or cut things. They are my little assistants until the time being. I've been catering for about three and a half years, just basically doing cooking a little bit longer than that. Come from a background of cooks and chefs and just soul food cooking. <laughs> so we can just wash these off and let them cook down. <laughs> I became vegan due to the fact that I was already vegetarian. So once I did a little bit more research, it was like a no-brainer to me. If I wasn't eating the meat and everything else, why eat the cheese? So I seen that the cheese had a long line of bad things going on with it. And it caused a lot of more issues with due to the fact that my son has asthma, I have asthma, he has bad skin. So I just literally just said, you know what, let's ace it all out and become vegan. Where? Whoa! Look at it! That's, that's your brain lyric. And it's been a great journey thus far. Ew, look at it. You have a little bit of, um, what you've been drinking doing? too much coffee. It melt. You took it in the bowl so it can melt. I have somebody that has a peanut allergy on this I'm not even so, When cooking vegan food, it isn't as hard as possible. To be honest, it's not hard at all. Can I get the applesauce out of the refrigerator, please? In the jar. And then you can it's just eliminating the things that you have out of your diet and putting the great things that you need in. I can't wait to start the setting. Can I get some milk, please? Put some water in here. Put back up for me. When I became vegan, it wasn't hard for my kids to become vegan at all. It was more so of the educational part. So what I did was I took them to the Minnesota Zoo and I gave them the history and the educational part about it, the reason why that it's not good to eat meat or why we should be vegan. Put some water in here, put it back up for me. Garlic. 
And a lot of people feel that you need protein, but they don't know protein comes from your vegetables. <laughs> Would I ever go in back to eat meat? No, I love being vegan. I wouldn't even second guess it. I wouldn't change it for the world, to be honest. This is just my lifestyle. There's no going back. This is my lifestyle. This is who I am. I don't want to dress anything. Okay, what's the pattern for this? 